All right, YouTube, this is the final installation. This one was the same way as uh, we started. We just cleaned them up. You can see all the ice. I just want to show you guys the new array we just put in. There you go. That's a new array. Okay. So that plastic you see in the middle is just to cover the wires, the uh, MC4 connectors, because um, we don't want to uh, cut or bring the the railing, remove it from the uh, from the uh, the roof and put some new holes there. We decide to leave it there, just cover that one. For the UV, at least, um, it's not going to be beat up with the sun for all the years. So we'll put that kind of PVC just to cover it. But we don't need that anyway. But uh, we just put it there. Folks, this is how the array looks like. It's cold and it's hard to breathe. That's why, if you hear me, uh, pacing, that's the thing. But everything's looking good. Same panels, 1280 here, 1280 here, and 1280 right here. So I wish I can able to do a three dimension so you guys can able to see all of them. But so far so good. Let me see what I can do. These panels are now producing power as I speak and uh, you guys can see oh there we go you can see these ones here from this location okay yeah and uh, let me slide this other way you can see them I wish I can yeah maybe the drone can do that but so far, so good, folks. This is just an awesome, awesome, awesome install. You see? I'll try to add all of these pictures back on the thing. So what do you think, sir? Well, I think it takes a big dog to weigh a ton. All right. <laughs> as long as that's what you, <laughs> that's what you think is fine. <laughs> yep, I think that'll work. Oh yeah, I got all the, they all, the same. they all look all the same, the same, uh, the width and uh, dimension, the height and the production, the voltage, the wattage, you know, all the good stuff. They're all the same. So folks, this is how we end up the installation for today. Um, Build the next one. So we have to add. Oh, I gotta give you a tip, right? Guys, here, two more panels can fit in here. And we can add two more panels on this other rail. And uh, two more panels on the bottom right there. If I can zoom that, you guys can see. Yeah, on my way down, I can show you. So that's gonna be another six more panels gonna attach to that. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna divide the system. So instead of having 1.5 kilowatt of each uh, array, having a 1.5 kilowatt inverter, so I'm gonna be uh, uh, getting a three kilowatt. So we can able to put um, eight panels, four panels in series, and four panels in series, and. Uh, um, it depends uh, what the voltage is going to be on or I have to check the specs so we might uh, have a higher uh, up to about 500 right now I think we are just within around the two, 200 some volt 200 to 300 volt it might be a 600 with a, a 3 kilowatt so I'm going to put a all in series series 
series and parallel them they're gonna be having a high um probably uh 16 amps so right now that one is just uh 1500 at uh 10 amps so we are fine so we can able to series and pair them comes from uh, uh, array one array two or uh, l1 l2 whatever the system says so we can able to have a dual mppt uh um a grid tight inverter that is going to take care of this problem okay and the other ones going to be um the other one's going to be just for the batteries okay or oh, maybe we can leave out a ray right there with uh, the 150, 150 uh, 1.5 kilowatts going to run on that ray. Then we just add the other ones for the batteries. <clears throat> okay, we can put uh, two panels here, two panels there, and two panels over there. So these are 40, um, 46, 46.8 volt, 46.8 volt, and uh. I can do a 24 volt system. We're still gonna be fine. We're in good shape. Well, this is how I'm gonna wrap up this video, folks. As I go down, and you guys can see, walking down here is not an easy task. You gotta have really skills of balancing. If you can't balance yourself right, well, you're in so much trouble. But even though we have, um, the stuff we're working with climbing up this roof but i'm telling you guys it's not it's not easy it's not everybody can walk on a roof it's nobody can no a lot of people are afraid of height but hey it's all done she's looking pretty i love the looks of this thing well we're gonna fire up the inverter and see the power we're bringing in yeah, it's looking pretty. Well, we walking down now to the shop and see, look at the chickens. Boy, look at these girls. They are doing pretty good. Wow. They are not even cold. Look at you, girls. Hello, hello, hello. Look at the chickens. Really nice chickens. Ooh-wee. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh boy. Come on, girls. Come on. Come here. Come on. Wow. Hello, hello, hello. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. All right. Look at that, they follow me everywhere. <laughs> Look at all this. Look at it, what's wrong with this other one? What do you guys think? You guys don't just like the chickens, they're really, really cool. What's wrong with this one? Probably sick, huh? What's that? This one. No, they don't like cold any more than I do. Cold. It's just more susceptible to cold than the other one. Mm -hmm. All right, we're walking to the shop now and see, guys, I'm going to give you a live footage as we go up there, transition, and see the power, how everything works here. Well, here we go. The breaker is off. I'm going to turn the breaker on, and you guys will see. Well, she's up. 
See, I told you guys, when you, you have to see DC part of the uh, panels before uh, it's going to do anything. Now it's doing a, a cycle. So look at all the screen is like frozen, almost frozen. Look at the numbers uh, <laughs> switching. Yeah, it's a connect in 264 to 15 and it's getting there. It's trying to connect and after that the green light is going to come on. No green light yet. It's communicating with the uh, with the AC part of it. There we go. I can hear the click. Shun. There she go. She's on. It's cold here. So we bring in 229 watt. 230 watts. Look at our weather outside. It's cloudy. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Let's check. Check this out. This one is bringing 210. And this one is bringing 125. So this one is the one facing the house. And uh, that's for the morning sun. And up to now, it's still operational. What about summer? And this is cloudy today. It's cloudy, no sun. Look at this. 207. And 221. No sun. We bring in a total of... 221 plus 204 plus one something, 127. So three, four, five, almost 600 watts we're bringing in. Yep. So what do you think? So we got a. I think we're rocking and rolling. Yeah, successful install here. Time to go warm up and find the general. Yeah. Time to go home, folks. My job, my task is over for the day. This is the array that is the incline. You guys are where the ladder was. So it's bringing 200 and, uh, it's 200, it's bringing. This is the one we just installed. The one um, very uh, at the center because it's facing directly the skies. So he's bringing 214. Okay. So that's 200. So it's 400, 530, 40 watt. Well, this is the way I wrap up the video with the install. If you like, subscribe, share. And uh, this is JW Solo USA. Thanks for following my channel. And thanks for being part of this install. If you haven't been a subscriber yet, subscribe, like, and share. From the command center and with all my crew, we're installing this device, uh, system. Thank you so much. And God bless. Have an awesome, awesome day. If you're in Minnesota, stay warm. If you are somewhere that is hot well stay cool <laughs> i love you bye 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 now and give a thumbs up like and share